Hey guys, welcome to my video. My name's Tom and I am the Rookie Horse Farmer. Uh, this is day two of uh, installing a new horse fence. So today I'm going to focus on this little fence line right here. Um, I'm not sure if I'll be able to do that side over there, but uh, we're definitely going to uh, take the back side here. Uh, things should go smoother today because um, I figured out uh, how to do it yesterday uh, when I set this up right here. So first things first, we have to take these guys out on the pasture in the back over there so that they're not in the uh, way when I'm working uh, or running away when they have the chance. So uh, I'm going to go and get these guys out on the pasture. actually ran into some problems over here where uh, the fence line would come over and meet this in like a T section right here. So you can see the neighbor's fence and then our fence. And uh, this was a 
seriously a mess of cables you can see here I just cut it to get it out of the way but I'll have to spend some uh, additional time uh, getting all of these loose wires uh, off of here because uh, right now they're just basically being a danger to uh, our horses and the neighbor's cow which is I don't know if you can see but hiding way over there um, so uh, I'll uh, take some time and uh, clean this pole up. There we go, that's uh, all uh, cleaned up now, so uh, I can uh, get started with actually putting the fence up.
So as you saw, I had to bring out another one of these. Um, there just wasn't enough to reach the next pole on the last one. So it took me a while to figure out how to join it here. But what I ended up with was to wrap this sort of around to the back here. Um, and then I wrapped this uh, in between each layer and uh, secured each and every joint all the way down. Uh, so that took me a little while to manhandle that into uh, uh, place and to fasten all of those staples. Um, these that are on the back here, I'm going to do something else with them. Uh, I'm just running out of time right now. So I'm uh, doing the front, making sure that they're pointing towards the back so that when the horses come back they, they won't hurt themselves. But uh, I still have all of this left and uh, I have a somewhere I need to be by six o'clock today which is less than three hours away so I have to do all of that in less than three hours because it's going to be dark otherwise so it's a uh, crunch time again
There we go. Managed to finish it off. This is the end piece here. Um, not exactly the prettiest. There's still a lot of spikes hanging out here, but uh, they're all tucked away. And uh, I can uh, do a better job on that tomorrow. Uh, the main mission today was to finish this entire area here, and I did so. So uh, that's good. I had to take a break in the middle there, but um, also I'm noticing that, like if you see here, the it's kind of like wavy. Um, there's no real good way of straightening it out that I've found. Uh, if you know of a way to do that, please let me know, because. Uh, uh, any help in uh, making my life easier is much appreciated. And uh, now I'm going to have to take the horses in, but today I am going to put that uh, gate to. Um, sorry, I'm a little out of breath. I'm an old guy, uh, old gamer actually, so, uh, you know, this isn't exactly how I envisioned I was going to be living in my middle years. So I'm just going to fasten this here, see, through here, and through here, and then we get it stuck. There we go. So, and then put it on here, there we go, so that's secure, now to get the horses back in. Okay, there they are, this time I'm not taking any chances, I got my harness here, so uh, let's see, I'll just put this down here, and then we're gonna see how it goes. So that's one down, two to go. Although I have a feeling that this guy over here is gonna be uh, problematic. He's uh, a little shy. I guess someone didn't uh, like the idea of being alone out here, so uh, we're going to close this gate up real quick. Now we got one pony where she's supposed to be, and an Icelandic where he's supposed to be. And of course we've got uh, Bakari, who is in the wrong space. So I uh, have to figure out how to separate these two now. So, uh, yeah, so uh, ended up uh, walking through there by himself, I just had to keep him away. And of course, um, this lady figured out that I'd left this door open, so uh, she was of course right here in the hallway, enjoying life, and she's going to try again, no, no, you stay in there. Yeah, you stay in there. That's right. Mm -hmm. So now I can finally give them uh, food. And uh, I have half an hour, roughly, before I have to uh, be at a neighbor's. But it's just down the road, so I should be able to uh, feed and uh, take a nice shower.
Well, that's lunch taken care of for Saturday. So uh, that concludes uh, day two of my fence project.